President Hage Gengob has expressed shock at how Namibia is being rated globally on human trafficking. Reacting to concerns raised by a visiting American senator, Ben Cardin, at State House on Friday, the president says there was no way the government will allow people to be enslaved. Dr. Gengob challenged the U.S. Embassy to produce concrete evidence proving that human trafficking was rampant in the country. A group of five senators from the United States of America arrived in the country on Friday to study wildlife trafficking and problems that relate to poaching. The aim is to partner with countries in southern Africa and see how they can combat the scourge, the idea that President Hage Gainkop is happy with. But one of them almost threw a cat among pigeons. Senator Ben Cardin says, from the reports that he read, human trafficking is also a problem in Namibia and urged the government to ensure that people are protected. I would just urge you to take attention to how prosecutions are done so that there's a clear signal to those who participate that it won't be tolerated here and that you're, you're working uh, to make sure that the people are protected. And I, I would just urge you to, to give this attention because it's just not what Namibia is all about. But the issue is news to the president and questioned how it is happening and which people are being trafficked. So we never allow anything like this. We are honestly telling you, Senator, we don't know what is being said about this trafficking. Maybe there have been some prostitutes maybe who have been picked up, you have to have in America too. So I want to make it clear that that report is meant to unfair. It's the first time I'm hearing it that my country is doing so bad. International Relations and Cooperation Minister Netumbo Nandindaito are also questioned the information which he says might not be verified or interpreted differently. You find incidents which are reported if a child is found in a household and is asked to go and collect a firewood or is asked to go and collect water at the water point for the report that is child labor. Let us understand your interpretation of child labor, your interpretation of trafficking. The senator has promised to share more information about the report to the president. Meanwhile, President Gengob thanked the U.S. government for the Millennium Challenge Account grant, saying it has helped Namibia to move forward. That was the most successful thing that happened in Namibia from the United States. That kind of uh, system we got from the United States went a long way. But you stop it. But you must renew that kind of system. The senators also met the civil society at the U.S. Embassy on Friday and visited the Nankuse Lodge and Wildlife Sanctuary outside Vinduk on Saturday. Tonatenishidudu, NBC News, State House.